Until recently, the relationship between the United States and Vietnam was complicated by a highly contentious issue, dioxin contamination from wartime use of Agent Orange. But now we are celebrating a major milestone in overcoming this issue, the successful remediation of dioxin contamination at the Da Nang International Airport. Spills during Agent Orange handling left many parts of the airbase unusable and exposed the city's adjacent population to a persistent and toxic chemical pollutant. The United States Agency for International Development, or USAID, partnered with Vietnam's Ministry of Defense to tackle this wartime legacy. Over the last five years, a group of engineers and scientists use an innovative, permanent solution to clean up the contamination at Da Nang. American contractors built a football field-sized structure to contain contaminated soil and then applied a patented American technology to heat the soil to over 635 degrees Fahrenheit or 335 degrees Celsius, thereby permanently destroying dioxin. Vapor and liquid released during heating were also captured and treated Following the first treatment phase, a parcel of decontaminated land was handed back to airport authorities in time for Vietnam's hosting of the Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation Summit, or APEC Summit. The planes of dignitaries and leaders from around the world are now parked on this clean parcel. We will hand over a final portion of decontaminated land in the coming months so that the airport can expand its air cargo capacity facilitating future trade of high-value American goods, turning a painful reminder of the past into a symbol of positive collaboration for the future.